Natural disasters are really but one element of a pre-planned set of actions that each and every nuclear plant in this country and in fact around the world have on the shelf and ready to go. We call that our emergency plan and it, natural disasters uh, are one element of that. We also have it for uh, terrorist events, potential terrorist events and all of these plans have been developed over time uh, with the idea that uh, by pre-planning these actions, we're able to uh, train our folks to be prepared and ready to uh, implement them in order to keep our plants safe uh, in the event of a, a particular event like a natural disaster, a hurricane, or an earthquake. I have personal experience uh, with hurricanes in Florida at our plants, and I can tell you that the benefits of having an emergency plan, practicing that emergency plan, training, uh, the uh, employees at the site to implement that plan and practicing it repeatedly pay off when the real event happened. Uh, we have had several hurricanes where we've operated and uh, safely through the hurricanes. We've shut our plants down. We've uh, kept the public fully informed and I think the public was appreciative that we were um, focused on safety and that's really at the center of what all of these emergency plans are and that's why at what we're seeing now with the Fukushima event there's a series of pre-planned actions that were in place uh, before the event ever happened all designed around protecting the health and safety of the public.